right, we're asked to find the exact man. value of cosine of 17 pi over 12. Okay. Um, so let's think to this. Let's think about it. I need something quite large, right? Um, let's, let's think about the center unit circle. This equivalent would be 0 pi or 24 pi over 12. Does that make sense? Yes or no? What's 24 divided by 12? Okay, so this is going to be pi. So 12 pi over 12 is just pi. So what's this one going to be? 18 pi over 12. Because 18 pi over 12 reduces to what? 3 pi over 2. So I know that my I'm here in quadrant 4. Does that make sense? Okay, talk to your partner. 30 seconds. I need two numbers that add or subtract to be um, 17 pi over 12. Talk to each other. Ready, set, go. Should you gain two numbers? Anybody got two numbers? Yeah. Seven pi over six? And? Eleven pi? So that would be 14 pi over 12. So you just need how much more? 3 pi over 12. Does that make sense? 14 plus 3 gives you 17. And class uh, 3 uh, pi over 12 reduces to what? Pi over 4. So again, you can find a bunch of combinations, but this is what we're going to choose. This is our A value. This is our B value. Uh, with your partner, I want you to explain uh, other combinations that work, and then I want you guys to finish the problem together. Ready, set, go. So write down your formula, do your substitutions of your A's and B's, and then we're just evaluating. Right, equal 2 over 2 minus sine S7 pi over 6. Negative 1 half. And pi over 4. Does this problem look familiar? Same spot, right? Negative 6 pi over 4 plus, right? You see the plus? Radical 2 over 4. And then these are not like terms, so you can just do uh, negative 6 plus radical 2 over 4. I want to point out a couple of errors over the years. When you're evaluating a trig function like 7 pi over 6, you don't write cosine. So a lot of times I would see a student write like cosine and negative radical 3 over 2. That would be incorrect. You, a trig function at this angle is negative radical 3 over 2. So what I'm trying to say is from this line to this line, you no longer have the trig functions anymore. You just get numbers only and simplify. Okay? Hello, man. I love me.